Hello again, welcome to another Let's Play Golders. Yeah, I've decided to call them Let's Plays, although I'll still keep that image at the beginning where it says MGA's when plays. I will title them Let's Play because, like I put on uh, Twitter, that it's, it's a bit conceited really, we, you know. Oh, MGA's when plays, oh yeah, come watch me. <laughs> uh, I, I'm not like that. I, I would, you know, I'm just another, uh, just another gamer who wants to share his gaming experience with people. So, um, so anyway, uh, as you join me, um, I think if, if you remember last time, I was, I don't know if I mentioned that I was going to be, I've gone the wrong way now. I was going to be expanding. Um, Stuff. Uh, but I still haven't been able to find any shrines on the other part which will allow me to expand over that way. Um, so what I thought was let's expand over this way. As you can see there, the other thing was I was going to start recording a little bit earlier just before this one on the right here had finished. But the phone rang, and so obviously I had to take the call, blah, blah, blah. And now, here we go. So, <clears throat> uh, I'm not sure what happened with this shrine, because two of the people that were working on it died. Which seemed a bit strange, because it, it seems funny, the last uh, couple of shrines, such as the one... That's over here um, because I've, I've added some some abodes to uh, to the the land. Is it that one? Oh, hold on. Is it? Oh, there's that much space <laughs> available to me now. Uh, I think. Now this bit, that's right, this is where the uh, the totem was, because I had to get people over here. Because I thought, well, if I bring people over, maybe that will help expand the, my influence sort of thing uh, and spread it further. So, maybe, I, I think it might work like that, actually. So, uh, right, I've got some people here. But the thing was as well, when that shrine was finished, there were three people working on it. I tried to get three followers working on each shrine because it gets done quicker. Um, but for some reason, when they finished it, it finished. Uh, it finished. Duh. They disappeared, which was strange. So, yeah. Not sure what happened there. That's... Uh, a bit of a mystery. So anyway, the latest developments are two new expansions. Uh, I think I will start with this one. Uh, as you can see, there's quite a bit around there, so I'm guessing it's going to unlock all that bit. Uh, so let me back a bit, back a bit, back a bit. There we go. Um, can't zoom out any further, that's as far as it goes. So let's click on the card and Tada Land Expansion and Watch as it unfurls. So that's that. And how far do we get? Oh, seriously. Uh, it, it's not quite reached there. You've got to be kidding. There's nothing else. And that's as far as it will reach. Right. Okay. Hmm. But anyway, that's uh, that's that one. Now let's uh, 
What's that one over there? Let us go to this one, which, as you can see, should uncover obviously that bit there. Land expansion. Expand the land. And that's as far as that one goes. Right, okay. Not very far really, and that leaves that chest down there still inaccessible. Uh, it's not really opened up much more than I already had. So, hmm. Yeah, I mean, I, I was looking up online. Apparently, if you play some multiplayer games, uh, that will give you different cards and things and whatever. I've got to be honest. I don't want to play multiplayer. I mean, I don't mind doing like the Mount of the Gods thing, which is like against artificial ale. I don't mind doing that. That's perfectly fine, but. I would rather just keep it as like a single player thing. I've got to be honest, I don't know why, I just enjoy it more that way. I mean, I am really enjoying the game as it is. Single player experience, just expanding land, finding resource cards, and, and whatever. Uh, you know, that is my personal preference. Um, and so, I can't really see how or why any cards would, ex you know, expand any further because you do tend to need, um, yeah, the shrines to expand. And they don't appear to be any. So, what do I do? The only thing I can think of um, is that I will play some more Mount of the Gods. I would love to record playing Mount of the Gods battles, but it slows down that much. Uh, I really can't. I mean, I'm sorry. It's my sister, you know, playing on a laptop and blah, 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 blah. Um, I did win the last one, and B. Plimmer was my opponent, of who is now a resident. Because the, the 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 main card that I received uh, from winning uh, the the battle was uh, that they moved in. They, uh, I forgot what it said now. I, I did take a screenshot. So uh, so anyway, uh, yeah. Um, it's like I said, as much uh, as much as I would like um, to, to, it's not nice if you can click on that and. Uh, Hmm. I mean, sometimes uh, this uh, that kind of gives you a bit of a hint, the chat of like what's going to go on. Um, okay, I'll, I will try this battle. I will try to record it. If it's too slow, then. 
Um, I don't know what cards and gems apparently is uh, something. I'm not sure what that means. I think that means they've got to get like two, up to ten times our uh, population or or whatever. Um, send your folders to my more gems than the enemy. This is another one where you basically got to you know, get more popu population and uh, and whatnot. Ah, I'm guessing then that if I do this one, that will unlock the mining ability and sell so that gold strip, which I. Uh, which are discovered yeah. by the joint head. Should be able to start mining that. It's not that I really need gems at the moment. And then I've got something like 105 of them anyway. Um, but, uh, ah, there's the the mine, okay. So what I need to do is basically get rid of this here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the reason I was saying that I think see how it's opening up more space. I think that's what I might have to do on what is basically the homeland. If you know what I mean. Um, I think that's what I need to start building uh, more the bells and whatnot. Near the edges of uh, you know, of my influence, I guess you call it, and, uh, Get the people to build the bows over this way, then that will bridge the gap to uh, to the other island. And uh, Oh, we're going to build one of those big forts uh, type building. So, okay. What is that? It's just those few layers. Okay. Looks like they're already yeah. uh, there, so yeah. let's place the totem there and get some people out of there. Yo. Yeah. Yo. Yeah. 
Where are we going? Let's uh, clear up there. Hopefully, they will start just mining. Uh, ah, there we go, yeah, straight away without having to be told. I'm in there, guys. I'm mining fast already. Oh, this is probably why there are the fights here. Get there, beat them. So come on, get mining. So I just have to pause that slightly. Um, let's uh, get people over there mining and building a boat if we can. Deactivate the totem. Then hopefully, what I will do is then move on to the. Uh, well, to basically mine more gems and uh, and build a barrel so that. Click on people, and you know it saves them having to come from all over the other side. We do seem to be. Oh, time's almost up. I think is it? I don't know. It looks going a bit funny. <laughs> One of the things that does appear to be happening is the parts where they have mined, it turns to swamp. Uh, we appear to have quite a little mining town here at the moment. There we go. And, um, it does look as though. Yes, 
Wait, one. Ta -ta. You have witnessed my first battle win. Well, recorded battle win anyway. Uh, send your followers to mine more gems on the enemy. Da -da 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 -da. Okay. So, here we go. Back to. Uh, Ah, there we go. So, okay, the, the game seems to pause a little um, while it's kind of reloading back to the main bit. Um, so, I just paused the recording for a, a little while. Okay, here we go. So, I get a small mineral rock uh, god card, a hidden cache of gems, which gives me another five gems. That's not that much. But. Uh, we get a felt resource card. Mm. Ah, another oak resource card. And that will go towards the stone cottages. Jolly good. Yes, go away now. And finally, aha, there we go, the mining card. Oh, now then, I have got a few of the, uh, the coal resource cards. Ah, but this also requires two elk resources. Ah. Which basically means it's still going to take a, take a little while to uh, to level up. But let's check the information. It says the effect followers gain mining ability leads to smelting and logging. Uh, early civilizations mined stone, clay, and metal, and glasses of the earth. Yada, 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 yada. So there we go. Uh, I have unlocked unlocked mining, but I still need to collect the resource cards. Which, if I click on that, there's the coal. Oh, four. Okay, that's uh, one more than I thought. And, uh, and that's it. Well, there you go. That was my uh, first recorded battle. <laughs> that you just witnessed there. It was, as you could see, it was a quite an easy one, but it does open up uh, the mining ability once I've collected the the, pro the correct sources, obviously, and that means there I will be able to mine all this. So there we go. Not exactly sure how much I will get out of that, but, uh, but yeah. Okay, right, I'm back. Uh, what's it? Family, eh? who would have them? Uh, right. But all it, yeah, all it is. The wife's been out shopping. One of the kids looks out, tuk, tuk, on the door. I'm like, oh god, what now? Mum wants me to show you these. Great, two packets of bacon, lovely. Yes, bacon, but doing something. <laughs> right, anyway, okay. Uh, so, what I will be doing if. But I don't think it works the same way. On the homeland, as it does in in the battle, where if I send somebody down here to build an abode, will that expand the land? It's something I will try out. Uh, let's see. Um, well, I thought I could move the totem, but obviously not. Let's just have a quick look through yeah, Finger of God's Swamp. Aha, there's the Meteor Strike, it's opened up. Um, it's Highlight and Ada, Volcano, no. Right, okay. So, let's place the totem. 
there. Because there's a, a, a plot just there of which if I can just expand this bit uh, a little bit more. Whoops. Oh, well, there we go. That, that, that'll do. Uh, let's go and get some followers. Uh... Okay, these guys won't do. They've only got to come down that way. Now, this, like I say, is an experiment. I don't know if it will work. Because, I mean, there's a shrine right there, and my, the end of my influence is there. And there's no other shrine uh, that I can see. And so I'm guessing that that, because of the... Uh, the abodes here, it kind of limits the uh, the area of influence. Um, people are almost there, so once they get building, let's deactivate the totem so that the other ones can go and build. Uh, other ones. Because the thing is as well, there's that one there which is being built literally just outside. Hmm, but from previous experience I couldn't, I could still get the belief from that about. But Uh, I, I couldn't really build too far into that area. Um, and this is why I say I, I really hope that I, I don't have to play what you might call proper PvP multiplayer because that's something I, I just don't want to do. That's my personal preference. I would rather play just a single player thing, if you know what I mean. And do those like Mount of the Gods battles against AI rather than real people. Um, but it doesn't look as though this is going to be any more effective. It kind of looks like. I'm going to be able to build these abodes and that's it, they're just going to be abodes on the edge <laughs> on the edge of influence which is a shame uh, I, I, am, you know, I was hoping to, you know, to expand I mean, look, see that, that island that I call the, uh, the Stonehenge Island it's right there, y'all. Right there. And just not going to happen, is it? You know, I mean, my people are right there. That island is right there. Uh, I can't seem to expand with a shrine. And so, all I can think of is that I need to do more battles in the Mount of Gods, Gods of Mount, well, yeah, yeah, and see what unlocks with that. Uh, I mean, that house is now, those abodes are now finished. 
and the area of influence is still the same. This is a bit of a bummer. Uh, I mean, I've got all these bulbs over there. Yeah, you know, I can literally like, get tons of belief in all this stuff. But even this part, it th there's no shrine for me to restore and you know expand any land that way. So what am I to do? A little bit baffling. I mean, the fact that I uh, managed to open up so much land on this side, and I don't mean so much as in a lot, I just mean just so much, <laughs> so little, I guess you could say. Uh, I was quite surprised that that is as far as it goes. It doesn't even open up these. Odd little bits of land here which have obviously got nothing of value. Unless, unless behind it there's some kind of uh, unless there's something behind it and no, nope. well, there's nothing behind that one. Uh, no. Uh, so, uh, once again, you've got another ton of trees that takes up now a bunch of resources and slows everything down. Um, but yet again, no sign of any shrines this way. And there doesn't appear to be any sign of any resource cards either. You know, it's as if I've come to a come to a little bit of a standstill sort of thing. It, in terms of uh, In terms of like expanding and and things like that, I mean, it, I guess it would be the same with this bit where you think that more would be, you know, it would be more widespread. Uh, I, I have to admit, I, I'm a bit uh, a little bit stuck. So, um, like I said, I think I'll do some more battles, see what I, you know, see what I get out of those. And, uh, because I, I, when I had a quick read up about, you know, basically why can't I expand anymore, uh, he was saying about doing multiplayer stuff and more Mount of the Gods stuff. Uh, there are ten battles apparently just in the, the primitive age and so um, I guess I'll work on those but for now uh, we are on we've just broken 40, 34 minutes on this one continuous section although there were slight pauses in between it's one continuous video this time now not, nothing broken up or whatever um, And I even get disturbed by the wife as I'm signing off. See, unbelievable. <laughs> no, no peace for the wicked. So, anyway, uh, thanks for watching and uh, join me next time. Thank you. Goodbye. Ta da. Toodaloo.